You know, in the beginning, art had no name. Art turned the unseen into the visible, the tangible. Art made the mysterious less frightening. Art had purpose. In the beginning, art was so integrated into the community that music, dance, poetry, painting, and the narrative were not separate entities, and they had purpose. Traveling around Mother Earth, I'm using a woman's cut wing dress as the mother, which we refer to the Earth as the mother, and notice she has peaceable hands. In another way, I've taken Our Lady of Guadalupe and transformed her. So you are one of the few in the United States, and the only one I know, that has an arts council, a Native American arts council inside the museum. So you should be very proud of what you've accomplished here. Oh, I know from fact she's here with me today, so it's yeah. very, yeah, the faith is still here. Things you're trying to do with the work, some parts are really working. Most artists work from their own, you know, from your own personal experience, mm -hmm. and um, eventually what happens is, as you keep doing this, um, these pieces may meld together, may, may merge the two styles, and you'll mm -hmm. create something that will be your own handwriting, because that's what we all search for, is our own handwriting. Um, she is completely um, needle felted over wrapped wool, and in order to support her, I have to make a skeletal structure out of wire. Painted it on clay, as well as made the clay into I want to get the message out there, so like in this case, this was a tiny cheek piece about, you know, our 200 years. They may not know what Oche Wat Te Te'u means, but it says on the sign. So I think about that. I think about people sitting there in the outdoors enjoying yeah. it. Yeah, thank you. And thank you. Thank you.